this isn't just an innovation centre, it's also a training centre. But you've got heat pumps in bits, you've got heat pumps being explained, and they're looking, I think, around a thousand people a year to come through this training centre and to be trained in heat pumps, in solar, in inverters, whatever. It's all part of that net zero journey. Important training centre so that we have that workforce for the future. When we think of heat pumps, you always think of these big, angular, quite chunky, square things that aren't really that attractive, are they? Let's be honest. And they're stuck in front of homes. Octopus have got something a bit different, I think, which is really interesting. This is their Cozy 6 model, but I mean, look at it. That doesn't look like it can run up to 65 degrees, which is far higher than what we used to see in heat pumps. I just think it's just, as you'd expect from someone like Octopus, just reinventing and doing something different. It's got all the science in it, but it doesn't have to look like a traditional heat pump. So one of the questions is always about heat pumps is, will they work in the hot, will they work in the colds? It's a bit of a myth, but Octopus take this really seriously. What they have here is a testing lab. So we've just been talking to one of their engineers and they've got one of their Cozy Sixes in this room. And in this room it's set up, so it's minus seven and 80% humidity which sounds perfect for Blend of Stinyog in the summer to try it out. Um, so they're testing it in those cold conditions. And I think in the next one down there was a hot conditions as well. How does the heat pump work there? It's really important that somebody's doing this work and this is what Octopus are doing, is testing how these heat pumps work and making sure that the right heat pumps are getting deployed for the right scenarios.